Hey y'all, welcome back to another banging video. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a get to know me plus kind of like life update and answering some of y'all's questions. So I just feel like I'm on social media a lot and I get questions here and there like, oh, how old are you? Or like, where are you from? Where, where were you born? Things like that. So I decided to just incorporate that all into one video. And that's what I'm here to do today. So we recently hit 5,000 subscribers. I'm extremely grateful for each and every one of you. Like truthfully, from the bottom of my heart, I'm so grateful for all of y'all. And I also recently had my first ever collab with Protein World. So shout out to them for believing in me and just like being the first company to send out some of their stuff to me. And I did do a video on that if y'all want to check it out. Like I said, though, I really just want to sh like give a, a, a bigger shout out to y'all for just helping me get to like where I'm at. Um, I love my YouTube channel and I know that we are just going places. So we are on a road to 10K because I know we can do it. And I just want to keep growing and expanding and sharing my knowledge here with y'all. So yeah, that's what we're doing. Um, but 5K is still a milestone in my book. So thank you guys. Anyway, um, I'm going to go ahead and give y'all a life update slash, like like I said, answering some of y'all's questions. If you see me looking down, it's because I literally wrote um, some of the questions down that I get on my different platforms. So I'm just going to answer that and that's just going to be the video for today. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and get started. But before we do, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe to your girl's channel, okay? Because we're going places. All right. So first question, this one was kind of like obvious in my book, but I have gotten it more than once. So I was like, okay, let me address it. And it was if my, I guess like my social media names, but in here it says YouTube. If my YouTube name slash social media comes from my original name. So Patricia Isabel is the name of my YouTube channel, my Instagram, everything. And it does originate from my name itself. So it's not like stage name or something else like that's just that's my, that's my name so that's my channel's name but yeah next question was how old are you 22 i feel old i just turned 22 though i just turned 22 in january so i'm a capricorn but yeah i just be feeling old sometimes i don't know why and it's crazy because everyone's like you're still a baby you're still a baby but i'm like nah but i feel old i just feel old so I'm still a youngin though, like to be honest. But anyways, yeah, I'm 22. I was born in January. Um, so my sign is Capricorn because that was another question what my sign was. I'm a Capricorn. All right. Where were you born? So this one gets confused a lot. I was born like here in Miami, but I'm from Puerto Rico. Like I, I would go back and forth when I was to Puerto Rico and back when I was very little so I always developed like the culture over there the language like the food like that's really I feel like that's really my heart and then but obviously like in terms of like you know being born and where I'm living right now it is Miami so yeah I'm a Miami girl but Puerto Rican in the heart and all my family is Puerto Rican like you know I speak it fluently and people usually when I speak it they're like oh you're from Puerto Rico like your accent and I'm like yeah and people do confuse me a lot that i'm from new york but i'm not i'm just not <laughs> next question okay so we're gonna get to the juicy ones i guess it's not so juicy but if i have a boyfriend so i'm no i don't i am currently single and just really like focus in school and stuff i'm not that type of like girl to be like oh i'm looking or i'm seeking like no, whatever God puts in my path, God puts, and I'm on his timing. So if it's not right now, it's not right now. If it's tomorrow, it's tomorrow. If it's a year from now, it's a year from now. Like, I I don't really trip over those kind of things. But, um, yeah, whatever. I, I'm, I just put it all up to God, basically. Next question. All right, I'm going to skip that one. <laughs> It's like, I feel like I answered this one, though, like in another video, though. So, nothing. Because um, some of y'all be asking some crazy stuff. And this video is not supposed to be too crazy, okay? It is kind of late right now. Like, I low-key, it's going to be, like, 1 in the morning 
I just got home from my friend's um, birthday thing. But I wanted to sit here in front of the camera and do this video for y'all because y'all are important to me. But some of y'all are crazy for some of the questions, okay? <laughs> so anyway, um, okay, we're going to skip that one. Okay. What are you majoring in? So I am majoring in, in biology because I am trying to become a pharmacist. Actually, I'm going to manifest this because that's what I've been practicing these last few months. I will become a pharmacist. I am currently a pharmacy tech. If you know me or are, you know, not new here to my channel, you're going to know that I've done so many videos on how to get hired at Publix or how to become a pharmacy tech, things like that. So that's currently where I'm at. And so um, I'm studying to become a pharmacist. I got to apply for pharmacy school and all that good stuff. So I'm majoring in bio because that is the pathway that has the most similar amount of classes that I would need for pharmacy school. So I'm just trying to take all those prereqs in the meantime so that I can go then apply. Um, Next question. Actually, I'm going to do a few updates. I would say just so that y'all can get to know me a little bit more because yeah some of y'all's questions are not so much like getting to know me but just like asking some crazy stuff so i have two dogs i feel like that's just a good icebreaker and just some good for y'all to know because loki what my dog is right there she's like on my bed right now because she cannot be away from me but yeah, I have two dogs. I have a husky, Luna, which is her, and she's going to be uh, four. And she's like my baby. I mean, I've like raised her since she was like this. She was so small. I mean, she looked like a potato. She was the cutest little thing. And I would take her around in a stroller and just, I mean, I've just like, I'm, I've been that dog mom, basically. So I guess that I like enjoy talking about her. She's my wall screen. So yeah. So there's that. And then, um... I also have another dog, which is my sister's dog. But when my sister moved back to Puerto Rico, I stayed with her dog. So that's my other dog. And she's a mixture of a Schnauzer and a Westie. And she's a little bit older, though. She's 15. So, yeah. But she's a cute little thing. And she's still acting like she's five. Like, she got all this energy. She's healthy. Like, age is really just a number. Like, what? So, there's that. Um... I guess I'll talk about my favorite food. So it's crazy because just today I had Haitian food for the first time ever. And I don't know if it was like, I don't think it was typical Haitian food, like a plate of Haitian food. But it was like, I have a group of friends and um, I literally just came from her, her party thing. And she's Haitian and she had hired like this Haitian lady to cater um, her food. And she wanted Haitian food. So the lady made or catered to her party Haitian food. Um, but really, like, the, the names of it was, like, just, like, it was barbecue chicken wings, barbecue meatballs, mac and cheese, just, like, typical foods. But I guess they make it maybe with a different sauce or seasoning or style. And it was so freaking good. I mean, like, guess, 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 guess. Island people just hit different. Island people know how to cook, like... I just love a homemade plate of, like, food, bro. Like, it just it hits so different. <sighs> I'm sorry. I still feel like I'm on the boat. We just came from off a boat, and I'm, like, my head is... I'm still like this. Sorry. So, next up, I got a question here on my iPad that says, if I go out like that... So, I'm assuming, like, the question is, if I go out often or if I if I go out like to Miami and stuff a lot um I'm just, I'm just gonna assume that that's what that question meant because it just says do you go out like that so I'm pretty sure that's 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 what that means I'm really like a homebody like truthfully a lot of people who meet me first of all a lot of people who meet me think I have an RBF face which I don't I don't see it but I can see maybe how like somebody else can see it um but then they get to know me and they're like, oh my gosh, you're like the opposite of what I thought. So I feel like people associate RBF or they think that I'm going to be like mean or, you know, a, you know, y'all know what I'm trying to say. But then they get to know me and they're like, damn, you're like the complete opposite. And I'm like, yeah, thanks. Like, I get it though, because if you see somebody and you feel like, oh, okay, they look mean. Like, I can understand then why they would think that I'm mean, but I'm really not. And so they peep that 
after they get to know me. Um, also, going back to the question, if I go out like that, um, so, so yeah, I'm just like a stay at home body for real. And people associate that, associate me though, when they meet me and they t have this perception of me, like, oh yeah, she goes out like that. She's probably a party girl. She's probably this and that. And I do not go out like that. I do not. I do social media. I'm an influencer. There's certain things I need to post, certain things I need to, you know, like be at or like portray or this and that. And so I do that because at the end of the day, this is also my job. Like people be forgetting that. Like this is my job also. Okay. And I file taxes on this. Like, like this is a source of income for me, you know? So anyways, I do what I need to do. Um, but I really just do not be out like that. I study a lot. I work a lot. So I don't even have the time or energy. And sometimes, honestly, like the friends to do that. I'm selective with who I hang around. I'm not just going to hang around anybody. So if my two solid or three solid friends can't hang out, I'm not just going to go with anybody because oh, I want to go. Like, nah, like I'm, I'm good off that. So I really do not be going out like that. I very much be at home. I'm a homebody. I rather, honestly, at this point right now where I am in my life, like Netflix and chill. Is that what they call it? Well, honestly, that probably means something else. And I'm, I'm not with that. But genuinely watching Netflix, like Grey's Anatomy and eating popcorn. And I'll probably do this with my homegirl because if you tell a guy Netflix and chill, they automatically think something else that's my kind of night at this moment so i really be doing that with my homegirl a lot or like two of my homegirls will just like get together at my house we got blankets popcorn snacks and a good movie or show like that just be a breath of fresh air so that's what my, i feel like my stuff consists of um next question is if i have a type um again i'm just like assuming type um, like type of man like is that it so I do not have a, a specific type of man that I'm attracted to like oh I would you know date this type of person but not this one like it's not like that for me at least um I'm a person who really gets turned on by personality by the way a man treats me I do not want a boy I would like a man and like I said a man who treats me right is the one who is my type I guess so, I mean, yes, I feel like I am attracted to guys who are maybe a little bit taller, like things like that. Like, I'm not going to lie. You know, I'm not going to sit here and be like, I would, you know, like, it doesn't matter. Like, short, tall, skinny, big. Like, I'm not going to do all that because there are, you know, like, I, I might have a preference. But, you know, I wouldn't say I have a type because I'm not opposed to, you know, I guess a certain like way somebody looks I just really like personality and if I find you attractive then okay cool like we're good like you don't have to be you know a specific anything if I find you attractive and you treat me good then we locked in that's how I see it we locked in so dang why am I nail tripping so with that being said that kind of like concludes today's video those were some of the questions y'all asked. I feel like I addressed the most important things, like basically talking about me, talking about what I like, talking about what I do, just things like that. Um, I just like for y'all to get a feel for me as a person because at the end of the day, like I'm human, I have feelings, I'm sensitive. Like truthfully, if I had to describe myself, I'm a person who I feel a lot for others. Like I do really have a good heart. So um, it's important to know like the person you watch or like, take advice from because i get here on my comments like oh i took your advice and i got a job or i got this and that it makes me so happy it really does i even had this girl at school come up to me like oh my gosh i follow your youtube you've helped me so much like this super sweet girl and like i don't know i, I like it makes me so happy but it, like i said it's very important for y'all to know like who it is you're taking advice from things like that so i just wanted y'all to like get a better understanding of who i was um but with that being said i'm just going to conclude today's video thanks so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe because i'm coming with the bangers and i'll see y'all in my next video bye